Hey guys, what is going on? I'm here to tell you right now that anyone can get access to a tool similar to Jasper, but it's completely free and I'm going to show you exactly how we can use it for Redbubble, print on demand, etc, etc. Go on Google, type in open AI beta and click the first one. Make an account, log in, very, very simple stuff. You'll see this here. You can sign up with Google, whatever you want to do. You just want to click on playground here. Um, shout out to Ryan from uh, Ryan Hogue from Ryan's Method for showing me this. I had no idea. I was using Jasper all the time because my company pays for Jasper and for other things, Jasper is definitely better. But I wanted to show you a couple of things that we can actually do um, using this tool. So the first command is write 50 print on demand t-shirt slogans. You can just see that. They're all really, really funny, to be honest. They're all really, really good. Some of these are just, they're just the same over and over. Okay, let's do 10 instead of 50. I think because, I think I made it panic when I said 50. Let's just do 10. I'm too pretty to do homework. I'm too pretty to work. I'm too pretty to get up early. These are all really, really good. This is, I would make these designs for sure. I think these will sell. Um, Let's just have a look what comes up if I search for it on Google. Really? People found it offensive. Oh, come on, dude. Online complaints. Oh, it's a joke. It's just a joke. What's wrong with people? <laughs> oh, God, what's wrong with people? I love seeing Shopify websites, or this might not be Shopify. I don't know what, what it is. Let's have a quick look. It's not Shopify, uh, WordPress, no. Okay, it doesn't really matter what it is. I was just curious if it was Shopify, it's an independent store, it's really, really badly made. Uh, I cannot find Redbubble, uh, which is interesting. Let's just type in Redbubble here. Oh, it might not exist on Redbubble, hang on. This might be an amazing keyword for Redbubble specifically. I'm too pretty to do homework search. It, it's got to have some results. Maybe it's copyrighted. Uh, it's probably copyright. No results. Oh, okay. Interesting. Okay, so what we can do after that is we can do write a product description for a design that says I'm too pretty to do, to do homework. This saves us a lot of time um, because it basically means we don't have to write a product description for every single product. If you're uploading 60 products, you know how annoying it can be. Make sure that um, this is actually true. So it says the background is a light pink and the design is completed with a few simple styles. So either make that true on the design or you know delete this and um, maybe describe the product a bit better here. So for a design, black and white vintage sunset. Okay, whatever. And then let's press submit again and see if that gives us the black and white vintage sun so it's perfect for any room in your house. Okay, great. So obviously it doesn't work perfectly. Jasper works a lot better for this kind of thing, but you can use it for this. The final thing I tried was write uh, 10 tags for a print on demand product that says, okay, let's see if this works. No, it doesn't really work. You could use these, but they're not they're not gonna be perfect, so. Okay, let's talk about some of the things we can do with this. So I really like it for niche research. Okay, so write 20 Mother's Day niches. You can replace Mother's Day with anything, okay? So it's gonna take a while. Sometimes they'll be good, sometimes they'll be terrible. So I don't like these ones. Let's submit again. Oh, okay, uh, let's change it a little bit. So write 20 Mother's Day t-shirt niches. Let's try that. I heart my mum, I'm a mommy's girl. <laughs> I'm a mum's best friend is a pretty good one. All of these would be fine, to be honest with you. I'm a mum's caretaker. Let's get rid of these, and you can just press submit again, which is the beautiful, beautiful, beautiful thing about this. You can just keep pressing submit until you get something that you really like. I'm a proud mommy. It's probably a really good one. Again, probably quite competitive though. Okay, these ones are a bit better. 
So let's say super mom. I like the idea of super mom. So let's take super mom and then we'll say write 20 super mom t-shirt ideas. World's best mom, number one mom, proud mom, blessed mom, awesome mom, etc. etc. Another thing we can do, let's delete this again and write slogans instead of niches and press submit. There we go. I'm a supermom, what's your superpower? Supermoms do it all. Supermoms never quit. Supermoms are made of steel. Supermoms are always on the go. Supermoms are organized. Supermoms know how to get things done. All of these things are things that will almost definitely sell in one way or another. Yeah, I'm not paying for this, guys. This is completely free. So it says upgrade here. I, I, don't, I don't think I'm, am I paying for this? I don't think I'm paying for anything, wait. Oh, okay, I am paying for it, but like I'm paying such a small amount of money and I have, uh, you have $18 of credit when you first start. I actually thought this was completely free. I didn't realize I, <laughs> I, didn't realize I was paying for this. Uh, I'm not actually paying anything because you start with $18. I don't think I added any payment methods. Okay, so I haven't added payment methods, so you don't even have to add payment methods, which is uh, perfect. I've only used Okay, so you've got six months to use $18. I've used 30 cents. From this video today, plus the research I was doing before, I've used 20 cents. So it's really, really cheap, okay? And most likely, you can just make another trial account if it runs out. Okay, the final one I'm gonna try are 20 t-shirt slogan ideas. I'm just gonna run with this kind of thing. And what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna try and find one that I think is good. These are all really, really generic. So let's just submit again. This too shall pass. <laughs> These are all really cliche. So let's try uh, non cliche. Hmm. How do you get rid of the cliches? I don't want cliches. Uh, right, uh, 10 funny. There we go. I'm not short, I'm fun sized. I love that. I'm not lazy, I'm on energy saving mode. That is absolutely hilarious. I'm gonna search for that. Where does it get this from? Is Redbubble not here? Right here. Let's just type in Redbubble uh, so that we can find this page here, which is exactly what I want to see how many results there are. Only 101 results. That's pretty nuts. Final thing I want to do is check if it's actually a good keyword, which is by using this free tool, Ahrefs Keyword Generator. Uh, this is probably not going to come up with anything because it's got, um, oh, it does. Coffee mug, perfect. T-shirt, perfect. As soon as you see these kind of keywords, mug, T-shirt, etc. funny sloth coffee mug, interesting. So now we know to add a sloth. As soon as you see these kind of things, you know that people are searching for this keyword, which is perfect. The final thing you can do is I'm not lazy and then write I'm here and then press find keywords. And then these are all keywords as well, which we can use. And these are really, really easy designs to make on Canva. You can make these so quickly. So use Ahrefs Keyword Generator in conjunction with OpenAI. I'm gonna be playing around with this, guys. If you liked this video, if you wanna see more, let me know in the comments. I'll definitely be making more. This is absolutely hilarious. This is absolutely hilarious as well. <laughs> I think this is really, really interesting and I'm really, really glad that Ryan pointed out that you can just use this for basically for free. You don't even need a payment method, you just need an email. Thanks for watching guys, I'll see you really, really soon with some more content and peace out.